Hi guys, welcome back to Pine. In the last episode, we made it out of the vault, and now we have a new mission to go back to talk to Gary and Marla. So we're back up at our village, which I totally forgot that we could get back into. But it's fine. I'm going to see if there's any... Is there any food things to collect up here? No, there's not. It's fine. Okay. I forgot it, that you have to, like, actually legitimately jump it. Okay. Gary. Hugh, oh dear boy. You mustn't daunt us like that. We lost so many and then you were gone too. And I went to the out to do what a mom would have done. To learn and seek help. No, Hugh, it doesn't work like that. The out is dangerous. I bet you had to defend yourself plenty of times. Well, yes, but despite the continuing tremors on these cliffs, you are de we are determined to make it work. And you should be too. We need your help now more than ever to fortify our houses and keep cleaning up. I think we should get off the cliff. There are other options. Nonsense. Stay here and help us out. It has no use. The island is much bigger than this cliff, and the humans before us knew that. Stop it. Help us out here. Start with Iam. He has been asking for you ever since you left. I will go seek him. Oh my god, this is infuriating. It's, it's like... Huh, it is like... Listening to... It's like trying to speak logic to a brick wall. I don't like it. Hugh. Oh, mother's mercy, you are unscathed. I'm fine. The out is teaching me so much. The out is too dangerous for us, Hugh. Some of it is, but there are some who help, some very kind people in the out who helped me. They're going to help us? Well, they point me in the right direction. I think there must be a place we can live somewhere. We cannot live among other creatures. We would not survive, Hugh. We've always been here, and life on the cliff will find a way. But we haven't always been here. I told you, a mom and I found... We're defenseless against those large creatures. You've seen them too from the cliffside, no? Yes, and now up close. Some of them are not happy with us humans, but some are helpful. In fact, they helped me find a place called the Vault, which in which I discovered humans had been there before. It's where I found this outfinding, which could help us defend ourselves better and learn the ways of the humans before us. Thank you, Nydia. That looks very interesting. Looks dangerous. What are they gonna what are they doing to you, Hugh? You seem different. I am. They are showing me there there is more than this dangerous cliff. Please, Hugh, stop this nonsense. Put away that dangerous object and come help us here. There's too there's so much to do. I think you might be onto something. We cannot resort to these ridiculous options. We need to put our strength where it matters. Gary wanted to see you, if you haven't already. I'm glad you're back to help us out. Ugh. Okay, I gotta find a mom. Hi, Emma. Outfinding of yours. Very intriguing. I feel like I can open a lot of doors for you, or for us, on Albemarle. I think so too, but Gary doesn't seem to agree. Hi, Marcel. Hi, Hugh. Still no burial, I'm afraid. I'll keep pushing for it. There's, this is no way to treat the dead. Thank you, Marcel. Ugh. Hi, Nidia. Haven't seen you around lately. Not avoiding your chores, I hope. Well, uh, no. Long as you're busy. Okay, Nidia and Ilma, they're on our side. They kind of agree with us. And I'm very glad of that. Who it is? Gronk. Been thinking about light, lightening the mood with that game I thought of. But with all the rubble around, the hiding and seeking might be a bit confronting. It's nice of you to at least think about it, Gronk. It's true. Where is... Ah. Hey, Iam. You startled me. Hello, Iam. Gary told me to come and find you. Yes. I want to help you. 
I believe these cliffs will no longer will not hold us much longer. That's I believe so too. I am thirsty. Oh, so I went into that cavern that you mentioned to Marlon and Gary, and one of the contraptions there inspired me. Surely not as brave as you, but maybe you can use this elevator as a shortcut into the out. And one day maybe we can all follow you. I'm ardently beseeching Mother to help you sa to keep you safe, Hugh. Thank you, Ian. This is fantastic. Wish I had your courage, kid. You're just like your brother. Mm hmm. Oh my gosh, I love it. Okay, so it seems like I had to say this. It seems like a lot of the younger people agree with us, and a lot of the older people don't. <laughs> Tunisia. That object you found. Interesting. Aren't you scared of what it can do? Not really. It helps me be more efficient. And hopefully it shows everyone here that there's more to find in the out. Hmm. I think it does. See? Everybody who's much, much younger seems to be totally fine being logical and going into the out. And everybody else being heckin' stupid. Who's this? Mesp. There's so much to do. There's so much to do still here on the cliff to go back to how it was before the collapse. We all need to take a breather soon. I mean, I get that, my dude. What's over here? Anything? Paths down. Right? Yeah. Them paths ain't gonna hold much longer, guys. Alright, because this goes around to the other side where we found the stuff cloth before and we were doing things. I got it. I got it. Because over here is where a mom's hideout was. Yeah, in the corner. My mom. A mm. little well, sad. Okay, so let's go use Eam's elevator. Who are you? Khan. Keep thinking about Luya. Whatever you're doing out there, do it for her too. I will, Khan. Absolutely. We want to try and save everybody if we can. Not our fault everybody being stupid. Alright. Okay, we're down. Nice. Oh, that's so much easier. Okay. I, I did that though. Okay. <laughs> Some of them seem open to leaving the cliff. Nidia, Iam, I'll need to overturn the others. If we leave, we should do it together. You find another vault to see what the other, what the humans before us did. And perhaps another outfinding will help us further. The Tombas will probably know how to get inside. Visit the Tomba house. The heck is the Tomba house? Oh, so the heck is the Tomba. <laughs> is that what Off and Wes are? Maybe? I feel like that's logical. Big light. That's what that was. I was like, the heck is this big orange thing just sticking out of the ground? Weird. Anything in there? Ooh. Bell rock. I'll take it. It kind of feels weird, though, not having my bow equipped. But it is what it is. Puffle egg. Puffle feathers. Nice. I'm going to have lots to trade with our Fexel buddies once we get to the next. Oh, this is the, this is the Tamba house. Duh. I'm a stupid. But I already knew that, so it's fine. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. What, there are four of you? Ah, I win. I was betting it was going to take him at least a 
good few days to connect the dots. Off! Welcome back, Hugh. I would offer you to sit down, but there are no chairs left. Good of you to visit us. Est. Now that you are mingling with Albemarle's politics, powerful chiefs have been knocking on our doors. They're not happy, Hugh. Not happy. The chiefs are reminding... Our chiefs are reminded of a long... A time long forgotten, and wouldn't be too happy with you leaving the unstable cliffs. And yet, you are probably not here because you are having a jolly good time up there. Nort. North, south, east, west. I just put it together. But, as always, we have a way to help you. If you, if you help us, of course. We're probably looking to get another vault, no? Bet that newfound device of yours helps convincing the other simpletons up on that cliff. Well, the chiefs of Albemarle aren't happy with you poking around in the vaults, so they want to lock them down more securely. And neutral as we are, or appear to be, <laughs> we in they entrusted us with holding the key to the vaults. Well, you're right, I need to get into the vault, but... We have what you need, but we need you too. I wanted to ask you about a strange image and insignia I found inside. As expected, our narratives align. That's exactly what we need each other for. Oh? Oh, is it the claw thing? Yes. Okay. I love their little flags on the tables for each of the factions. It's great. You see, your arrival here reminded us of our unfinished research on an event commonly known as the Blunder. <laughs> oh, dear. One in which not only humans, but all tribes had a big role. That's the symbol I found. What does it mean? It's related to a great conflict on Albemarle. One that we decided to miss out on. Our home in the soggy woodlands was in trouble. And everything got a bit too hot under our feet. Which left a big gap in our giant collective catalog of knowledge. The others do not speak much about it. Apparently it wasn't a great time to be around here. Perhaps you will have more luck. We know that humans were involved, but we do not know how. The other species hold the answers. All of them have knowledge about specific part of the blunder. We hope to string it together, with you acting as our missing link. The litters, for example, who come from the fields. They seem dirty and helpless, but there's more to them that meets the eye. The Fexels are famous hustlers, coming from the Wedgwood. They're not hustlers. They will sense that you need valuable information, only to challenge you on anything they know they are good at. The Crockers are the shamanistic hunters of the woodlands. You'll need to earn their respect if they are to share anything with you. The Cariblins are sage mountain folk. They always try to school everyone, but often it's often about a lot more brute force when it comes to it. The Gobbledoos from the dunes won't even address us or you. They're not high class enough. Their vanity is the key to what they know. You might be the perfect figure to approach all of them. You're new, interesting, and you seem to get what you need. Uh, this seems like a lot. It is. You can tackle this in any way and order you like. Best of luck. Okay. Mmm. Peace tree and written insult. This knowledge will start circulating the islands through village trader. Whenever such treaties are traded, the two trading factions greatly improve or worsen their relationships. Okay. Okay. I now have the idea for a peace treaty. What's around the other side? Crockers. To be honest, they scare the living poffle out of us, Tambas. Yep, poffle. I keep saying poffle. They demand respect with their enormous posture and aggressive behaviors. The species is known, has grown into the impressive beast they are. From all the comforts of their human chores. They are proud to be warriors and have a famous initiation pro process for young crockers too. As Tombas have not been able to get far with them apart from the trivial trading. Luckily there's one ancient crocker shaman who we have been able to converse with. As he values knowledge, albeit of more supernatural kind. It's important that you perform their initiation ritual, which you do by taking taking and showing their high shaman some blood berries from their initiation cave. The old crocker resides in one of the towers in the soggy woodlands. 
She'll mark both on your map. Good luck. Okay, well, I want to do the Fexel one first because they're my buddies. So, yes. Fexels, masters of alchemy, but even more so of thievery. Very pleasant to converse with, but you have to be careful with every sentence. Legend has it they arrived on, arrived on Albemarle on beautifully crafted boats a very long time ago. That's my boys. They were in search of a place to safely work on their bombs, explosions, and alchemy. Hence why they throw splody things. The large crater you see in their capital village is a result of their early experiments. Your best way to get information is through a business partner of ours. Someone we barely trust, but we can, but can get the job done. Schnusky. Schnusky? I love that name. It's so ridiculous and I love it. Find that little fella, but be careful. If they do get to hustle you, remember, let them bet on something and they'll listen. Okay. Got a lot going on. Alrighty. Well, let's, uh, let's just collect them all then since we're here. Gobbledew are a tough folk to confer with. They dawn from the warm shades in the dunes. Evolved from an older species after losing the ability to fly, they have always treated us Tombas as low-class inhabitants of Albemarle, and anyone else for that matter. No wonder I don't like them. Their arrogance makes them mostly unapproachable. This is a shame, as they are knowledgeable and have the strongest historical preservation of all. You, Hugh, might be the perfect candidate to approach them. You're new and interesting, and more importantly, you can still pretend to be someone else. Something that hasn't worked for us Tombas. Craft this pearl necklace and present yourself to the Gobbledew capital as a human prince. So make them talk to you. A prince? What's that? Just use that word. I'm sure it'll be fine. Go on now. Um. Yeah, I know it's going to be suspended because I'm not friendly with them. But it also says that... Am I neutral with the Crockers right now? I thought I was hostile. Hmm. The litter is a simple folk, but phenomenal at organizing. They say the litters have hidden all their information relating to Blunder away in, with an ancient king deep inside a large cavern they originate from. You might have found its entrance already, but the secret to finding the information lies a bit deeper. Apparently, you need to be a cer in a certain state through a resource called Drulica. We haven't found it yet, but there's a monument near the litter cave that should tell you how to get the, to the king's how to get the king's secret ways of getting it. I don't know. For some reason, they left a trail of spistal sockets near it to find the monument. Bonkers, but that's how they are. Follow that trail, and you'll get the information soon enough. Good luck. Okay. And then, last one. The Carablins. Strong and proud folk from the cold mountains. One of the older species on the island. Unfortunately, they know that, too. They always attempt to teach everyone a lesson. The Thomas can't stand it. But I managed to bond with an exiled Carablin sage, Brenier, who lives in the mountains. In attempts to retrieve information, Brenier usually says the answers will come in due time, which is highly aggravating. Yeah, that's fair. Perhaps, Hugh, you have more patience than we do. The sage seems to know everything about their history, but hasn't let go of it yet. He seems to want to appear very wise, but does not always succeed to doing so. Please go see Brenier. I'll mark his house on your map. Okay. I have a lot of things to do. Oh my. Okay, so... Does that mean I have the vault unlocked, I guess? Or are they just... What is that? I don't know. I kind of want to travel that way there, just to... Here's view. I don't know what's down there. I still haven't gone to this bottom part of the island over here. Or this top edge. Oh, I never noticed that when you move the map, the mountain moves to center it. That's kind of cool. Bog's Haven. I feel like there's other villages through here that I just haven't seen. It's fine. Okay. We're going to go... Oh my gosh, I have so much stuff. Okay, well, first of all, whoa! 
have so many things. I can make them now. Okay. Efficiency plan. I still need another guard token to make another one of those, but... Outgrower shin guards. Ooh, if I get some Morrow here, I can make that. I have a sword, though. That's fine. Okay. We're gonna go up here now. Whoop. We're gonna see what we can see. There must have been some other kind of structure up here. Like, not just whatever this maze thingy is, but like, actually something else. If that makes sense. <gasps> How did I miss that one? Nice, I have 18. I need more. I, I'm probably missing some out in the dunes. Hello. <gasps> Hi! Did a little wavy do. Did a little salute wavy thing. Oh, I love the Fexels. Oh, there's one over there. Oh god, gobble do. I don't want to deal with you. You guys fucking followed me, so leave me alone. I see one over there. Nice, nice, nice. See what I'm talking about? It's right down there. Okay. Anything down there on the beach? I don't know. I need a pearl, though, if I'm going to do anything with the gobble -doos, so I'm not really going to worry about that right now. That's a future me problem. Not a current me problem. There are occasional musical cues in this that sound very Harry Potter-esque, and I'm kind of here for it. Whoop, nope. Bleaker. We're going to go get that orb. Because I want it. And we're right here near Fexel Village. Hi, guys. Hello. I'm just going to go get this orb thing down here because it doesn't appear like you guys need it. So I'm going to go do that. And then I'll be back up to trade you guys some stuff because I know you guys love puffle eggs. So I'm going to give you some puffle eggs. Sound good? Me? I mean, you guys are neutral with my dudes, so I will take that. Where is your... Ooh! Look at this little fire pit over here! You guys made some improvements! Who's this guy? <gasps> Schnusky! Well, well. A human needs a Fexel. Should be good. Small brain creature coming for help. How do you know I need help? Well, why for bomb's sake, why else would you talk to a Fexel otherwise? Because y'all are cute. I don't know everything there is to know about the blunder. Blunder, eh? We don't speak of it. We don't speak too much of it. But we're a helpful bunch, aren't we? So here's the deal. Our chief has been looking for a way to gain a bit more territory easily. Word has it you know your way around Albemarle politics. Help us take over the nearby village I mark on your map using our newly invented raid flares, and I'll tell you everything. I will gladly help our buddies. Raid flares can be used to call in raiders to attack other villages. If they are successful, the species that survive the raids takes over the village. Deploy a raid flare near a target village and watch as the attackers arrive. This only works on villages of a different species than the one you got the flare from. Okay. Well, no wonder I can't do that. It's okay, I'm going to trade with you real quick. Because y'all love some eggs. I will give you some eggs. What else do you like? 
Um, cross price. Okay, I'm gonna pick that up. There we go. And then I would also like to give you guys, what was it? Peace Treaty. All right, I will take that. All right. Y'all got lots of food. Okay. Whoa. That's cool. You guys are using it to cook your food with. Clever little foxies. I think these guys are just pretty much foxes. That's fine with me, man. Okay. Is there another Gobbledew village? Or not Gobbledew, what the heck? Okay, Wedgwood Watch. Not by it, not by it. Okay. Gobbledew's not what I was trying to go for. <gasps> oh, I only have to find a couple more. Nice. Well, I ain't getting across that this way. Because that, that's... That's death. Lots of key graphite. I will take all the key graphite. You guys have got a nice little village over here. I'm not going to lie. I would totally live here in real life because it's quiet. It's out of the way. It's in this cute little hilly, foresty thingy close to the ocean. I'd totally live here. Not even joking, I would totally live here. I love it. And I love our Fexel friends. I wonder if you, what happens if you get them max allyship. Do you, like, become inseparable best buddies with all of them? Because I would want that. I'm just saying. <laughs> Ooh. Puffle died there. Puffle definitely died there. Oh, pouchful. That's okay, I don't need the more wood right now. Uh oh bleakers. Oh, I forgot now that they're getting a lot more, uh, that their villages are getting bigger, so they're starting to travel in groups more. I forgot about that. I've also noticed, before I did that, there were a lot of, like, other species meeting in random places, and now I've pretty much only seen Fexels on this side. Did the Carablin village get, like, taken over and destroyed? That'd be some crazy shit, man. That's true. That would be some crazy shit. Okay, Bleaker Thigh, Alphafant Meat. Okay, so if I do get them... Okay, I got two Fexel Raid Flares. I don't need Marwood. I'm going very far away from anything I needed. Ah, oh, I didn't have my sword out! Carrots, alphabet meat, crossbones, alphabet meat. No leather though. That's unfortunate. Okay. Ooh. What is that? Is that part of the village? Yeah, I guess it is. Where did that alphabet go? What are you hissing at? Uh. 
You threw something. Oh, I see a Karen over there. Did I open this one already? I did. It won't let me open it now, so I must have done. Whoops. I did not mean to strike. What can I drop? I have literally haven't seen any use for the Beagleite thing. At least not that I can recall. Besides right now, I'd rather have the food. Heck. Okay, fine. I will let you guys have the roseberries for now. Bye, guys. I'm going the other way. Okay. Okay. I don't know what village is right over there. It must be the... Oh, this is... Or's Rest. Our buddies. I do want to try to trade with the... Hi guys! I do want to try to trade with more peoples. I do like that things are like lit up more. Oh, I can't get more out here at the moment. Sorry, not trying to be in your way. Hmm. Ooh, I see Alpha Fans. I also see a bleaker. Okay, where'd the other one go? Right there. Sorry, I just need more stuff to trade. I don't like killing things, but I need more things to trade. Is that more wood? Yep. I don't need any more more wood. I have plenty. No, I don't want to deal with the bleaker. Where am I going? That's a gobbledy village, isn't it? <laughs> I think it is, because this is the one that I did the whole took me freaking forever thing. Eh. Okay. Carablins. Oh god. Er, don't, 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 don't do that yet. I, I want to trade with you guys first. Okay. God, you're so hostile to us. <laughs> well, you guys like Marwood. I don't have, like, any of the other stuff that you guys like, though. I can give you the Alpha Fant meat, though. And the bleaker thigh. It's going to take me a while to get them back on friendly terms with us, though. That's unfortunate. But it is what it is. I'll be fine. I'd like to go check on our guys over here. I also would like to know where the other orbs are. I know there's probably some in the, the dunes that I've missed. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, you guys have like an actual like border thing. Was that there before and I just missed it or what? Uh-oh.
Got him. Ooh, lots of bleaker thighs. You guys want them? I will gladly give them. Gathering, trading, scouting, raiding. The schedule is quite static sometimes. Fopsky. You're fun. Love you guys. You guys are the best. I don't care if they keep saying that you're sneaky or whatever. They have little huts now. They didn't have those before. Or at least if they did, I'm fucking stupid. Hello. Faulty design. False plan that introduces bad idea. Bad designs for armors and structure causing villages to need a lot more resources to upgrade and build low quality armor. <laughs> what? Oh my god. Barrel mask idea. Tricky mask of lean iron and stuffed cloth designed, devised by Fexel species. Interesting. I do like this, that there's just so many different things. It's great. Uh, I don't have anything else that you guys want, but I will give you those. That's fine. I do need to find a pearl thing, so. Okay, I think actually my next thing is probably going to be to go over here and see if I can find any more of those, um, of the, the Amphiscus orbs, because I'm missing... Four of them. Yeah. I don't know where else they could be, but I'm missing four. So we're going to do that in the next episode. It's going to be great. It's going to be fun. And we're going to head that way next time. Hopefully I can get the Carablins up to at least a relatively friendly level with us um, and keep the litters from losing friendliness. So I don't know. We'll find out. Anyway. If you guys enjoyed this video, hit the like button down below, hit the subscribe button, notification bell, share and comment and do all those things, you know, the, the typical YouTuber -y thingies. Anyway, um, I'm interested to see now if I'll actually be able to get stuff from trading with people because I'm so frustrated that I can't just hit the thingy and then get the thingy. And I don't know why. I don't know if I have to trade and make it exactly even or what it is, but whatever. I'll figure it out later. Anyway, I will see you guys in the next video. Okay, bye.